Hey guys, uh, welcome back to another video. So welcome back to my channel, Tapshi Tech and Reviews. So today it's a little bit technical video, and it's mainly for uh, iPhone users. And yeah, with an and condition uh, for those uh, you know who edit their um, clips or videos uh, using the stock iMovie app of iPhones. So what happens is sometimes when there is a very long video or uh, when the, when there is a project with lots of clip in it. Uh, it becomes very very uh, tough to you know find out which particular clip is causing the issue so in this video i'll be showing you all how to fix one export issue which uh, i you know i encountered while editing a long video so it's about uh, 97 minutes video and uh, there were lots of clips uh, to be edited but at the time of export somewhere uh, after 10 minutes started uh, you know um, it was stuck there it was not moving beyond that so it was becoming tedious and wasting my time there is no proper way to debug or uh, you know find out what clip is causing this issue and there is no logs also to do uh, find that and there is no live rendering of the movie also uh, while it is exporting so it becomes very difficult to find out which particular clip is causing the issue and in this video i'll show you all how i debug that issue and what are the first things which you need to check uh, while fixing this issue before going to the debug process so let's get in the video and uh, find out how to do that so this is a video which i'm trying to export uh, it has started exporting so let's uh, wait for some time and uh, you know see check after some time uh, if it has uh, at least reached somewhere in between and this video if you see it's 97 minutes long it might take some time so it's been 10 minutes now and it has you know somewhere uh, reached and 10 percent maybe and if you see it's stuck there it's not going beyond that that point uh, you know and it's uh, it becomes very hectic to find the cause of this issue as there is no live rendering there is no debug information there is no logs nothing so uh, so if you see here it's still not moving it's there only it's not going beyond that so the quick fix would be to you know cancel this export and um, and open that uh, you know uh, project again and uh, there are three main things uh, which we need to check in our uh, you know the project files uh, or the video clips which you have added in the project we need to look for videos uh, which are less than two seconds and so it's taking some time to open this uh, project because it's a large uh, you know uh, uh, project it's almost 97 minutes long so here uh, as i as i told we need to look for uh, video clips which are less than two seconds and uh, uh, probably you might have added uh, some kind of freeze or you might have added um, uh, you know you might have decreased the speed or you might have uh, the third is uh, you might have increased the speed for the two seconds video which is causing this issue that the same thing happened uh, uh, for me as well if you see here uh, if you see here in this video there is one uh, this particular video it's less than two seconds and uh, i've added freeze as well for this not even two seconds maybe it's one second video and i had, I had added a freeze so that i can put a voice over here but it looks like that uh, really failed and uh, i need to you know uh, cancel um, uh, i mean reset this uh, reset this freeze and uh, add this audio somewhere else so what i'll do is um, i'll delete this uh, clip and uh, keep the audio at, as it is as a background and uh, try to export it now and hopefully everything should be solved so let's try that so it's not just for freeze it's also for uh, if you have you know um, increase the speed of a two seconds video or if you have uh, you know um, reduce the speed or slowed down the speed of the video which is of uh, less than 2 seconds it will cause the issue 
so it's better to you know either delete that video or keep the video as it is you know that length should be same or else it's going to spoil our precious times you know um, going through all these things uh, trying to export again and again and waiting for it to you know complete so now if you see it has gone beyond that you know that point where it was getting stuck and it's uh, exporting normally uh, so that is the first thing you need to look for uh, before uh, you know going to any debug process so, so if you want to if you're still not able to find a solution for that then you'll have to debug it so debugging is a uh, time consuming uh, you know uh, so what you have to do is you have to take the backup of that project um, so that you don't uh, debug that particular project so you take a backup of that project uh, by you know exporting it as a project not video and um, and then uh, you can import it again in iMovie and this time you'll have to remove the video one by one till the point where it was getting stuck and finally see what and where that uh, issue is coming from which clip that issue is coming from so hope everyone liked the video if you liked it please do the like button subscribe comment uh, let's catch you in the next video thank you so much bye